Are you looking to find a trending product to sell on Amazon? I'm going to show you how to take a look at the hot new release list of products that are selling on Amazon right now. And what you want to do is look at those products, innovate that product, make it better than the competition and turn that product into a money making machine. Yes, it's possible. Yes, I'm going to show you how to do it. But before we hop into the tutorial, my name is Pretty. I'm a six figure Amazon seller. And on this channel, I talk about how you can build wealth by using the web. So please feel free to subscribe and let's hop into the tutorial right now. All right, so I'm on amazon.com and what you want to do is click on the new release list. And this list is going to show you products that Amazon thinks are doing really well right now. And again, we want to take a look at this list so we can start brainstorming ideas and really just finding a niche that we want to get into. Okay, so let's take a look, see how this list is doing. So when I'm doing product research, I'm really looking for a product that's in between $20 to $60 because again, you want to find a product with a good profit margin, 30 to 50%, because you don't want to put all this time into creating a listing doing product research, taking product pictures, and all of the sourcing and shipping and all that. You don't want to invest into a product unless it has good profit margins, okay? So let's keep looking in this new release list and see what we can find. Now, you know, this calendar seems really new. It's $21 and let's, I'm curious on seeing how much this calendar is making. So what I'm going to do is click on that new release product and you want to use Helium 10's X-ray extension to look at an overview of the market. And if you want 50% off your first month, there's going to be a code down below that you can use to get 50% off. And again, guys, I use Helium 10 to do product research, to do keyword research, to spy on the competitors, to use this tool every single day. And it is one of the best tools for Amazon research. So that's, just a little spiel on Helium 10. I do recommend it and I've literally been using it for the last two years. All right, let's get back into this tutorial right now. So again, guys, this product is really new. It has 19 reviews and you know, it's a very basic product and it has a good selling point. If you wanted to source this from Alibaba, it would literally cost you anywhere from a dollar to $2 and they're selling it for $21. So, that's a good profit margin, but again, let's use Helium 10 extension, um, the extra extension to take a look at how this product is actually doing. Now this product is fairly new, so it might not have that much information, but it does have a lot of information on it, which makes me really happy. They're doing around $47,000 per month off of this calendar, guys. That's insane. This is a really, really good product. And again, they're really new to this niche, which is a green flag. I would definitely dive deeper into this product. And what I'm going to do is click on the actual product. Let's go back to the listing and go down a little bit to see the competition. So what I like to do is, excuse me, look at the four stars and above. I like to use the products down below to see how this niche is doing. So there are competitors who have fairly low reviews, 72 reviews, 73 reviews. You know, there are some that have a lot more reviews, but still this product is still a good product to get into because there's not that much competition and there are competitors with low number of reviews, which tells you that there is room to compete. So when I get into this product, Yes, I mean, I, pro I, I would think about it because again, all these calendars look really similar and if you can differentiate yourself, if you could innovate this calendar, make it better, maybe add like a motivational quote for every month, maybe make every month a different color. I don't know, if you can make this product stand out more and make customers click on your product, you will definitely get sales. And again, this guy only has 19, 19 reviews and $47,000 in revenue every single month. So that is crazy. Again, the new release products, I really do like looking at them because it really motivates you and really kind of opens your eyes to products that you probably didn't think about. Like I didn't think about selling a calendar, but now I'm thinking about it because Amazon's hot new release list will just show you products that 
are doing well on Amazon and you want to take advantage of them, okay? So this is honestly a good product idea. What I would do is I would save this um, product in my notes or I would just leave the tab open. I'll just go here, amazon.com, type that in and I will just take a look at the overall niche, okay? So here is this overall niche. What I wanna do is keep scrolling down, keep scrolling down past the sponsor and just see how many competitors there are. So product right here, I'm kind of drawn to because he only has one review and I'm really curious on how he's doing. This is a brand new listing. He just launched it. So let's take a look at how he's doing, all right? Um, Helium 10 X-ray extension once again. And he is doing around $5,500 per month. That's honestly not bad, guys. Like, he's just selling a calendar, you know, like, Making five thousand dollars off of a very simple product is nice. Um, would he could he have done things better? I mean, his product looks pretty much the same as everyone else's. If he would have differentiated, he might have gotten more sales. But again, he's still very new, so he could see more sales um, in the future soon. Okay, so the calendar was a decent product that you know i found off the hot new release list but i want to go back to the hot new release list and take a look at other products that might be potential niches we want to get into so let's keep going let's look into a different niche now i want to take a look at baby so let's look into baby let's see what baby is doing and this is interesting Baby Headband Organizer. Now, this product, it was originally selling for $29.99. I really like that price point. Again, you wanna look for products that are 20 to $60 if you wanna make a decent profit. This product is a newer product. I haven't seen this product. So, you know, right now they're doing decently well, I'm assuming. Let's take a look at Amazon X-ray extension to see how they're really doing. But from the listing, it looked like a decent listing. So right now it's not showing any revenue and you know, Helium 10 isn't always super up to date, which sucks, but it's okay. This product is fairly new and it's gonna take them a little bit to gather that data. So what we can do is look at the competition. So let's scroll down and let's take a look at the other products that are related. So here's a product that is very similar, large capacity hair bow holder. And let's see if there's another similar product. Okay, yeah, so right here, um, bow holder for girls hair bows. There's one that's really expensive. Let's take a look at this one right here. So what I wanna do again, use Helium 10 X-ray extension. And if you don't have Helium 10 X-ray extension, I highly recommend downloading it. You wanna have Google Chrome as your browser go to the app store, download Helium 10 X-ray extension. And what this extension does, it just gives you an overview of how that market is doing, how that product is doing. It'll show you the monthly revenue, the number of units they're selling per month, how many reviews they have, and a bunch of other very important stuff that you want to look at if you're trying to get into a niche, okay? So here I'm looking at this product that I just pointed out to you guys, and they're making around $9,800 per month. Now that is good. When I'm trying to sell a product, I'm looking for products that are generating at least $10,000 per month. And this is just on the borderline of that number. So honestly, this is a decent product. If you could innovate this product somehow, maybe change the color, maybe change the size, maybe make the material better, you could be looking at a very profitable product. And now when you're doing product research, you wanna constantly be thinking about innovations. You wanna innovate your product and make it better than the competitors. So your product gets picked over the competition. More clicks equals more sales and more sales means more money for you. And that's exactly what we want. So let's take a look at another example in the hot new release list. And I wanna show you how many product potential ideas there are out there. All you have to do is keep looking, keep spending time doing product research every single day. 30 minutes a day gets you so far when it comes to product research. And I highly recommend using Amazon's hot new release 
list to find potential product ideas, okay? So let's look at another product idea. And let's just look in clothing, shoes, and jewelry. Technically, um, I wouldn't do clothing because there are different sizes and that's just a lot more inventory that you have to order. Let's take a look at this clear sticky notes. Now I've heard about these and I wish I had them when I was in school. Um, let's see how they're doing in terms of, these aren't clear, are they clear? No, they're waterproof. Oh, they're translucent. Okay, so yeah, so some are translucent, which is nice. So what you wanna do is, again, let's take a look at Helium 10. Let's see how much money they're making, because again, it's very important to look at how much monthly revenue this product's generating, and also take a look at the monthly sales um, and monthly search volume to get a good understanding of if this niche is gonna be profitable. Now, this person is doing really well. Wow, they're doing $11,000 every single month in revenue. And, you know, that is not bad. This other one, the transparent white sticky notes are doing $15,000. So, I mean, come on, guys. Like, what else could you want, you know? Like, this is just little tiny pieces of paper. So, if I wanted to source this on Alibaba, what I would do is go to Alibaba.com, find someone that is selling these sticky notes, send them a message, ask them about the MOQ, which is minimum order quantity. And then you wanna ask about shipping, see how much it would cost for your first order, place that order, start working on your listing, and then launch this product as soon as possible. You know, your urgency is key when trying to launch products, especially if they're on the hot new list, because that tells you that there are people launching that product and right now is the time to compete. Once there are a lot more people in that niche, there's a lot more competition, it's harder to put your product out there, which is why you must take action as soon as possible, okay? Now, again, guys, this hot new release list is an awesome place to start your product research after you find a product that you wanna get into. So let's say I wanted to sell those sticky notes I would just look at the competing products. You wanna go down and you'll find products right here that are similar to it. You wanna look at these products, see how these products are doing and how many reviews they have. Again, you want at least three competitors with 50 reviews or less in order for you to get a green flag to get into that product because it tells you that there's room to compete. There's new people coming into that niche and that you could potentially come and do the same thing. So let's say I wanna sell this product. What I wanna do is write in that keyword, which is transparent sticky notes. That's the main keyword that I'm getting from this. And you want to put that into Amazon search results. Now, once you do that, you can take a look at the overall niche. And this honestly is a good sign already because there is someone that is very new in this niche. He only has 26 reviews, five reviews, 465 reviews, this is an older one, but still there are two people with under 50 reviews on the first page in the first four search results. That should tell you that there is a lot of potential to sell this product because again, there are new players that are ranking on the first page, okay? So this is a really cool product. Honestly, this guy is sponsored, but he only has eight reviews. And if you scroll down a little bit more, 23 reviews, um, 25 reviews, and again, you know, everyone is selling similar stuff, so you can come in here, maybe offer a different color pattern, maybe offer a pen. You can do a variation and make your product better than the competition so people buy your product over your competitors. So this is how you can find trending products to sell on Amazon. Use the new release list to find the hottest, newest products on Amazon, and by doing this, you want to continue doing product research after you find a niche you wanna get into, dive deeper, be an analyzer, analyze the market, think about how you can even innovate that product. And once you do that, you are golden, my friend. You wanna take action as soon as possible, launch that product, get it on Amazon, get it into Amazon's warehouse, and then start, you know, running ads for it or just ranking it organically. And I will make a video on how you can organically rank your products. All right, guys, this is how you find trending products to sell on Amazon. Again, use the new release method to find products that are doing well on Amazon that have newly been released. And what you wanna do after you find a product 
from this list, you want to dive deeper, you want to analyze the market, use Helium 10, use you know, your brain to figure out how to innovate this product to make it better than the competition. And then ultimately you want to take action as soon as possible, start sourcing the product, get into Amazon's warehouse and create an amazing listing that customers will be forced to buy from. Okay. So again, guys, I hope this method was really helpful. Um, leave me a comment down below. If you have any questions, I'll be sure to answer them. And I will catch you in the next tutorial. Before you leave, give me a thumbs up. I would really appreciate that. And I hope you have a great day.